The DevExpress HTML editor for ASP.NET enables you to deliver web applications with rich text editing functionality with ease. Whether it's a blog editor, email client, or simply exchanging formatted documents within your company, you simply drop the control onto the web form and instantly gain access to a text editor with an intuitive user interface that resembles a desktop word processing application. In this video, we'll introduce the ASPX HTML editor and take a look at some of its runtime features. So let's take a look. I'll start with a new ASP.NET website that has a blank web form. From the toolbox, I expand the DevExpress Common Controls group and drag and drop a new ASPX HTML editor control onto the form. From the Smart tag, I invoke the Auto Format window. Here I can select a predefined theme that can be applied to the HTML editor component. I'll select Aqua. You can immediately see the preview to the right. I click OK and the theme is applied to the control on the form. Now let's run the application to look at some of the runtime features. To demonstrate interoperability, I've copied some formatted content from our existing ASPX HTML editor demo. I paste the content in the editor and you can see that the formatting is preserved. The HTML editor features two standard toolbars with all the common features one would expect from a word processing application. I can use the built-in spell checking mechanism or add an HTML table to the document. I can use the insert link and insert image buttons to add hyperlinks and pictures. The second toolbar provides quick access to all the text formatting functions. Let's select the heading, change the font type and size, then change the color of the text. Let's make the heading smaller again. I'm going to add an HTML table. You can see the AJAX functionality being used to invoke and display the insert table form. I set the number of columns to one. I can further customize the table settings. However, for this demo, I'll leave them as is. I click OK and the table is created. I'll copy and paste the heading into the first row of the table. Then I'll proceed to add the image and the text to the second row. Next, I'll select and remove the original text. In the HTML view, you can see the code generated for the document. The Preview tab renders the HTML content as it would appear in a web browser. For more information, please refer to the ASPX HTML editor documentation on the web. Thanks for watching and thank you for choosing DevExpress.